Hi, happy Thursday. It's Alyssa from The Ripple Effect. A topic that I think is really important, and um, I touch on this often here and there with my videos, but it's the, uh, the theory, thinking, uh, understanding that we are creating our own reality. And uh, whatever is going on in our head is a choice and we choose our thoughts, we choose everything, and how uh, when we're having thoughts of something that doesn't feel very good to us, thoughts of um, distress, if we're focusing on something that is distressing us, um, I'm learning more and more through my life, especially lately, that I can be my own best friend and I can also be my own worst enemy. And oh, what the heck are we doing when we are perpetually focusing on things that upset us? And I, I do that, you know, more often than I want to admit and more often than I certainly want to do. And then I say, why am, why am I doing this? Why am I thinking about this person, place, or thing, fill in the blank? And all it's doing is make it's, I'm creating a thought that feels terrible and it hurts my heart or I feel my, um, you know, blood pressure rise or maybe it's just, you know, it's just, a, I'll just say in general, a yucky feeling. So something I'm learning is um, the power of, uh, I don't want to say being um, unaware or being uh, not respecting a current reality, if you will, but if we create our own reality, then why not create a reality that is more positive and, and more comfortable and more... Um, beneficial to our mental health, our, our physical health, our emotional health. And I, I would say that there's people out there who say, well, I'm a realist and I choose to focus on what's going on right now. And I don't want to be up in the clouds and I don't want to be in, you know, woo woo land, dreaming up things that aren't real. And then, and I think, well, you know, yeah, that makes sense. But then I say, well, if we're creating our own reality and our current state of mind, our current state of feelings, emotions are based on what we're thinking right now, then what is real? You know, do you want to have a reality of, of something pleasant or something unpleasant? And I, there's just this uh, thought process of, you know, they say, well, I'm a realist, I'm pragmatic, I'm focusing on what's going on, I don't want to be out of reality, and I, I know I'm being repetitive, but it's like, well, you're creating your reality, so what do you want to create? So I would say, if you have a tendency or you find yourself in, um, I don't want to say we're all habitual, but I, I think that we were maybe raised or programmed to focus on negative. It, it might just be the human, the human brain. Uh, I certainly am not an expert on, on science. Um, I'm focusing more on the spiritual aspects of life. But my point is, is that bottom line, uh, if you want to have a more positive experience and a more positive frame of mind and a more positive uh, reality in your awareness, then, um, and I certainly do, then, then we need to program our mind and focus on what we want. So I want to be happier. I want to be less stressed out. I want to be less judgmental. I want to be more go in the flow. And so it's completely up to me and how I choose to perceive events. So um, I'm, I feel like I'm thinking out loud here, which I do in most of my videos, but I really feel like I'm 
you know, really expressing thoughts in not a super concise way, but um, I'm, I'm hoping that this resonates with some of you or all of you who are watching and listening. It's just, I feel like it's time that we are kinder to ourselves and, and more gentle. And you know what, ultimately give ourselves permission to have a, a happier, more harmonious, comfortable, delightful existence because we can and it's possible. And I really feel like that's what God and the universe want for us is us to make our way to a more loving experience. And that begins with our thoughts and then our feelings. So uh, for what it's worth, I hope this was a a thought process that you've thought of and kind of pondered and and I hope it's helpful. Again, we all we're all worthy of the best. So let's focus on the best. And maybe every day just do one less negative thought, one more positive thought. And I'm not talking about ignoring things that are in our face. Like if we need to take care of something, we need to take care of it. But do we want to let that just crush us or do we want to go with the flow and have a different perspective a different perspective of it you know and just be more gentle about it anyway so with that I wish all of you a beautiful wonderful wonderful Thursday a happy weekend um, lots of blessings and I look forward to talking with you next week take care